So we've noticed another chick pipping out and we've decided to just go ahead and remove the egg turners, go into lockdown a day early because they are not on our schedule. Um, the humidity today outside is 60%, which is what we need it to be for the eggs inside the incubator. So we're just going to go ahead and just get this thing done before we have a disaster on our hands with all these chicks pipping out and we're still in the egg turner. So we're going to open it up. And we're going to take that first row of eggs and we're just going to lay them on their side. This is what you do when it's time to hatch out. Is you get them out of the egg turners, you put them on their side. And then this is the way they will hatch. You hold these. And you just pull it straight out of that main arm. Yes. All right. Gently, gently, gently. There's one other one already starting to hatch out. Make sure we know where that one is. All right, it's okay. Stop. Yeah, there's the other one. Let's show what the pip looks like. Tiny little crack in the egg. But it's coming out. So we're going to try and just rush not exactly rush through this, but go ahead and expedite the process so that um, these babies can, can come on out. There's a main arm that each of these connects to that. Um, yep, yep, yep. I have to pull it out. There we go. All right, so all the eggs are out. They're on the um, mesh. And down there below, you can um, perhaps hear there's a fan. Some incubators are called still air, and other ones have a circulation fan like this one does, which keeps the temperature uh, even throughout the whole um, incubator. Other one, it, you could have an egg that, I would test it with my laser thermometer, it'd be 99 degrees, and another one would be 102 degrees. And so this one keeps all the temperature even and um, the perfect environment. So we'll keep you updated as we do the hatch out, but we have felt the need to go ahead and go into lockdown earlier than we had intended. And um, hopefully this will keep the babies in a position to come on in.